what's up everyone? So today what I want to talk about is the pump. And the pump is probably one of the most important things when it comes to training for size and you know growing as fast as possible. It's getting that in crazy fucking insane pump in the gym every time you train. A lot of people are unaware of what the pump is, what it feels like, and the reasoning behind it. Uh, most people are training for numbers. All they care about is how much weight they're lifting. You know, um, that's all they think about is, is how strong they are. Meanwhile, their form is fucking out the window. Um, you go too heavy, you're training your ligaments, your joints, your fucking tendons are being strained. You're not necessarily training primarily the muscle. You have a lot of other things involved. So when you isolate and you go super strict and you squeeze and contract, you're training the muscle 100% and you're taking the tendons and the joints and all the other shit out of the equation. So the pump is definitely one of the most important things to think about while you're training is getting that insane pump. And um, what I like to uh, compare the pump to is basically think about having sex and uh, with a limp dick. Not gonna do too well, not gonna get too far. It's not gonna work out too well, correct? And a fucking erection is the same thing as a fucking crazy ass pump in the gym. You know, you just fucking blood fills up the muscles, veins are popping out, and you just feel like you're on top of the fucking world. And, you know, the harder the fucking erection, the better the sex, correct? The better the pump, the more your muscles are gonna grow, the better the workout, the more productive. And, uh, and it's a feeling that, you know, you just can't explain um, when you have just the most incredible pump. The burning, the pain, the sensation, the, um, the euphoria, I mean, it's just amazing. How you know if you have an insane pump is when there's so much pain in the muscle that you, you don't even know what to do with yourself. You're just like, holy shit. And it's, you know, you're not gonna get that without doing higher reps, squeezing, contracting the muscle. And also, you know, it helps to, uh, you know, if you're on anabolics, you're gonna get a better pump. Plain and simple. Um, you know, there's a lot of products out there that'll help give you a better pump. Um, there's, you know, there's people that I know that take Cialis or Valga before they train to get a fucking crazy pump. Now, I think that's going a little fucking too far, but um, plenty of people do it, you know, because that's how important the pump is. And uh, a lot of people out there are fucking missing out, you know, and um, it's funny because I'll post a video and I'm using, you know, fairly light weights and, um, you know, doing 20 reps, you know, or a thousand fucking reps all together, 20 reps per set. And, you know, people say things like, oh God, the weights are so light. And, you know, they just, they have no concept of, of what bodybuilding is. You know, it's, it's about getting your muscles as massive as possible and having the best symmetry and aesthetics you can have. That's what it's about. It's not about lifting heavy weight. That's not why, you know, why you do it. It, it's, it's lifting heavy weight is great. It's fun. You know, it's, it's, it helps with your goals and you see yourself progressing, but I'm just saying as far as bodybuilding, it's not always the best situation, you know, powerlifting, strongman. Yeah. 100% bodybuilding is a completely different fucking sport. And a lot of people, you know, they just don't understand that. will never understand that. You know, all they go on is how much weight they lift and how much they weigh. And the truth is, it's how you train and how you look in the mirror. That's what the fuck matters. The scale doesn't mean shit. Measurements don't mean shit. And you know how much you lift doesn't mean shit. It's all about what you feel when you're training. That's what matters. That's all that matters is what you feel while you're training. That's the most important aspect, not how much weight you're pushing. Um, now, my advice for the natural guys, as you guys know, that the natural bodybuilders, in my opinion, need to train for strength and need to go a little bit heavier. Um, you know, it's it's different when you're when you're taking steroids. It's different than training natural, and um, you know, it's a different way of training. Um, but as far as the eating, same shit. You guys need to fucking eat as much as you can. As far as the volume, you know, you can work your way up to doing just as much as someone on steroids. The body will, you know, adjust. The body. The body's an amazing thing, and you know the body can adapt to anything, and it will. So, um, you know, as far as volume or how long you're training, how much you're doing, as long as you're eating enough and sleeping enough, it's all good. Um, but as far as the way you train, you know, it's different. If you're on, you know, you're on a heavy cycle, you get a pump just fucking brushing your teeth, and you're like, oh fuck, 
Jesus Christ, my bicep's burning. You know, I mean, it's just some crazy shit. So it's a lot easier to get a pump. Uh, natural is a lot harder. You're gonna have to concentrate more. You have to do more reps. You're gonna have to squeeze. You're gonna have to really get your mind into the muscle. And um, you know, but it can be done, and it's fucking important. Very important. So uh, as far as growth as a bodybuilder, guys, you got to be thinking about that pump. You got to enjoy that pump. And you know, that's the goal is having the, the best pump you've ever had. Every time you walk in the gym, you want to leave the gym with a better pump than you had the day before. And um, you know, that's, that's hard. And the pump is what brings the pain. No pain, no gain, guys.